Film crews are scheduled to be in Macon next week doing prep work for a Hollywood production that will film downtown. Now, this one's a sci-fi flick called The Fifth Wave. It's about an alien invasion of Earth. Kristen Swilly stopped in on some downtown businesses to see how they're reacting to the news. At the vault. Thanks for calling the vault, it's different. And Dot's forget-me-nots. Women fashions and accessories. These two make an entrepreneurs say business is good. We have a lot of repeat customers and I'm still getting a lot of new customers. I had a lady from the Smithsonian come in and she said, where are these from? These are museum quality pieces. Both will tell you news of the upcoming sci-fi film, The Fifth Wave, shooting nearby is exciting. That's my store. That's Poplar Street. That's where I live, you know, mm -hmm. right there in the movie. So it's exciting to have movies, you know, made in Macon. Hill says his business has been on the big screen before for both 42 and Need for Speed, and the movies bring in money for Macon Bib. An early estimate of direct economic impact based on hotel room, catering, services, uh, per diem for actors and extras is anywhere between $400 and $450,000 to our local economy. Macon Bib spokesman Chris Floor says Main Street Macon reached out to business owners and those who live in the area about their needs, but Hill says the shop owners' profits can some sometimes wind up on the cutting room floor. He says while 42 was being filmed, things got tough. Around four to 5,000 in sales that we lost and then um, probably two to three the next month because there was just still, it kind of changed the pattern of uh, people's shopping or coming downtown. He says that's due to people who don't often venture downtown, still believing the business was closed, even after shooting wrapped up. But he says this time he's being compensated, and he's optimistic it's all for making bibs greater good. But we've seen, you know, Macon represented in these other movies, and we're just really excited about it, promoting Macon, and uh, getting the people around here excited about downtown Macon. In Macon, Kristen Spilly, 13 WMAZ, Eyewitness News. Film crews are expected to be in the downtown area from January 2nd through January 13th. Parts of Cotton Avenue and 2nd Street will be closed during filming.